Holy, I can only do what I can do. Dad okay? sucks, you guys. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I have that. I have this. Wait a minute. I'll get your ass. And you had none of them in the moment. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. Okay, but... A shit. This father and daughter duo are currently rebuilding an old sailboat. The boat is a 1983 Trans World 41 foot catch named Bob. Yep, you got it. Bob. Bob is in a slip in the beautiful Deltaville, Virginia. That's Buddy. He's an Australian cattle dog. He goes everywhere with us. That's Nicole. She's flying the drone. And over there behind the mast, well, that's Dad. And his name is Nick. We are Saddles and Sales. And we really appreciate you watching our show. Have a great night. Bob gets a slurper. Y'all are a bunch of pervs if you took that any other way than the way I'm about ready to describe. Is what my little overthinking self came up with. A high capacity, independently powered water transfer system that I call the slurper. It started after I realized that the bilge pump runs on the 12 volt system. And if the 12 volt system doesn't work, neither does the bilge pump. And that's bad. So I started asking about independently powered, high capacity water pumps, way more than what a bilge can handle. And my husband found this little Honda engine transfer pump. Now that we have the pump, we went to the hardware store for some fittings. Buddy's a big help. He'll carry stuff around the store and all the way to the boat. <laughs> He's such a land lumber, you guys. He's never going to go on the boat. Ever. That's a fine crew. Richie is Nicole's landlubber husband. He's never going sailing, but he is very handy. He took the day off from cutting trees and moving dirt to come help me understand how to hook this thing up. A few moments later. Well, it's running and ready to install. So I'm down here in the forward cabin. I'm going to install the slurper. Before I install it, though, I need to put some holes. Look at me, I'm getting to that point where I really like holes. So, new tool, hole saw. Let me show you what I'm doing. A little tight. So, this is the top of that closet, and this is the porthole. Essentially, a hose is going to run out the porthole to the pump, which will sit here, down, and I'm going to drill another hole, although later on this week I'm going to be pulling that white tube out, that's the waist, uh, waist hose, and I'm getting ready to pull that out, but um, until I do that, just maybe backwards, I'm going to add a little space where I would have been able to utilize the space, I'm going to add a little space, I can always patch it later. Um, so. Give me a minute here, and I'm gonna put these holes in. Okay, hold on. Time to run the hose. 
All right, so I pushed that down there. Now I'm going to push this through to the bottom of the bilge. <laughs> Somewhat losing my prime, but we'll talk about that. I can fix that. All right, here is the pump. This is the slurper. This is the plumbing. And that's the exit plumbing. This is to the bottom of the bilge plumbing. So let's find out. Alright. Full throttle. On the start? Yeah. Alright. Maybe it won't start on full throttle. Um, maybe not. Or maybe you're out of gas. No, I'm not. bottom. All right, right to the bottom. Right to I the bottom. I can't believe you didn't video. Holy, I can only do what I can do. Dad okay? sucks, you guys. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs>